Gold Rush Update Among all the personalities featured on Gold Rush Chris Dutt's journey is arguably one of the most remarkable and demanding throughout the series though it has more than proven his worth consistently delivering exceptional results on mining. Expeditions over the years he's developed into one of the most dependable members of Parker Schnabel's crew with countless standout moments that underscore his expertise. However, there's one particular instance that stands out likely making fans pause and appreciate just how indispensable Dote has become to the team Chris Dutt's swift problem-solving. Secured a $600,000 Discovery Gold Rush is a show built on extremes, extreme risk, extreme pressure, and extreme Rewards the stakes are always high, and success or failure can hinge on a single piece of equipment working is expected. When things go right, the payoff is huge. But when they go wrong, the consequences can be devast, stating this constant. Balancing act demands that the team not only be skilled in mining, but also have a deep understanding of the machinery that keeps the operation running. Intuition, experience, and technical know-how are often the deciding factors between hitting it big or walking away. Empty-handed in one episode, Chris Doma demonstrated exactly why he's such a valuable asset to Parker Schnabel's crew. The team was facing an issue with a critical pump that had malfunctioned at a crucial point in their operation. The situation was precarious. Without the pump functioning properly, the entire day's work could have been at risk while the odds didn't seem favorable at first doll's expertise shown through he quickly diagnosed the problem and with some assistance from his fellow crew members was able to get the pump working again the tension was palpable as the team anxiously waited to see if the fix would hold and if the day's efforts would pay off their hard work was rewarded in a moment that likely left fans speechless during the gold weigh-in the team learned they had pulled in an astonishing 33,745 ounces of gold worth roughly $600,000. It was one of those classic gold rush moments where the crew's persistence and technical skill came together to create a truly triumphant outcome. Parker Schnabel always results. Driven couldn't have been happier with the day's haul and Dom's mechanical prowess played a PIV role in making it all possible. This moment was a testament to Don's deep knowledge of the mining process and equipment knowledge that has been built up over more than a decade. Working in the field by this point in the series Doet is no stranger to overcoming challenges, but this particular success stood out as a prime example of how critical his contributions are to the overall success of Schnabel's operation. What makes Dutt's journey on Gold Rush even more intriguing is the unconventional path that brought him into the mining world when viewers were first introduced to do in Season 1. He wasn't even supposed to be part of the mining crew. His initial role was far removed from digging for gold. He was simply there to help build a cabin for the team in Alaska, but something about the mining lifestyle captivated him, and he quickly found himself drawn into the work what was supposed to be a brief stint turned into months of staying on site learning the ropes and eventually transitioning into a full-time minor this unexpected shift set the stage for dama to become one of the most beloved figures on the show appearing in every season since his debbie doll's rise to prominence wasn't without its share of changes and challenges early on he was part of todd hoffman's crew but like many others he eventually moved on in season four he joined forces with parker schnabel a decision that would prove to be highly beneficial for both men Shin known for his relentless pursuit of gold and his ability to consistently deliver. Impressive results saw in Doet the kind of reliability and expertise needed to succeed in the grueling world of mining. Under Schnabel's leadership, Doet found a team where his skills could truly shine together. They have tackled some of the most challenging mining operations featured on the show consistently pulling in millions of dollars worth of gold while Schnabel's strategic decisions often take center stage. It's clear that the contributions of his crew, especially Doet, have been vital to their success. Do's self-appointed title of pomologist is more than just a quirky nickname. It's a reflection of the deep,
Technical knowledge he brings to the table as fans of Gold Rush can attest. Dew's journey from carpenter to gold. Miner has been nothing short of. Extraordinary his dedication skill and problem-solving abilities have made him an indispensable part of Parker, Schnabel's team, and a fan favorite in own right, whether he's fixing a pump, under pressure, or helping the crew pull off another record-breaking gold haul. Dalek continues to prove that he's one of the most capable and dependable. Members of the Gold Rush crew, his story is a reminder that sometimes the greatest successes come from the most unexpected. Beginnings Chris Dew's story on Gold Rush is a testament to the grit hard work and determination it takes to search for gold in the harsh conditions of the Klondike and Yukon Territory. On the hit Discovery series, the crews pushed themselves to their limits to hit their gold targets by the end of the mining season among those taking on this. Monumental challenge are Parker Schnabel and Chris Dillette both battling the elements and unexpected equipment. Failures in a race against time dolls. Journey into gold mining wasn't a straightforward one before joining the mining business he worked as a plant. Carpenter, however, since season four, he's been an integral part of Schnabel's crew, contributing not only with his skills, but also with his upbeat personality, which has become a key asset to the team's morale despite the grueling work though it always manages to make room for a little fun and believes in the importance of downtime for the crew the high pressure environment of gold mining inevitably leads to tensions as seen in gold rush season 13 episode 13 big gold energy when fred lewis and his stepson christopher parker have a heated disagreement over equipment breakdowns the stress of the job is intense which is why do it actively promotes moments of relaxation to help alleviate the strain in a featurette for season 10 of gold rush the dirt do it reveals that he regularly invites Parker, Schnabel, and the rest of the crew to his cabin at the end of each week. This tradition gives everyone a chance to unwind and enjoy some fun activities in what Doet calls his gold room from dark. Games to hitting golf balls do ensures there are plenty of ways to stress its stress relief, he explains, adding that the team uses the time to relax, share drinks, and catch up. The highlight of these gatherings is when Schnabel himself tries his hand at operating a remote-controlled motorboat, discovering just how powerful the toy can be as it zooms across the water much to everyone's amusement in the same featurette. Schnabel humorously shares his thoughts on Dutt's well-stocked collection of toys. It's it's a source subject with some of the crew nobody else has any time to do. That kind of stuff, Schnabel laughs admitting that he too enjoys taking a break to throw a few darts during these visits doll's ability to balance hard work with moments of fun makes him a unique and beloved member of the gold rush crew his positive attitude and efforts to keep the team motivated show that mining for gold isn't just about the technical skills it's also about maintaining the mental strength to keep going season after season thank you for watching this video